So there are some tools out there in the college and certainly talking to your peers is one of the best ways to get support and to help you when you're starting this for the first time. Uh, we at the School of Business have a School of Business policy so that a student, if they are abusing or using the laptop for non-course related activities while uh, the teacher is, a pr uh, professor is um, discussing or having an in-class activity, they are given an, a written, an email warning and that email warning is copied to our chair and it does go on their academic file. Uh, the second time they are given another warning and that time they are asked to actually go and visit the chair and meet with the chair before they come back to class to explain uh, their um, activities and then the third warning they can be uh, removed. Um, we've never had to get to the third warning I'm very happy to say it usually is just the first one. There are also some programs that use e-tickets so these are tickets that uh, are a nice subtle way to not embarrass a student in front of their peers necessarily, but draw to their attention that they have been using their laptop inappropriately. I haven't used them since I've developed the active learning tool in my laptop program, but in the three-year business administration program, it's not entirely a laptop program, so some students have devices and some students don't. Occasionally in there, the ones that do will be on Facebook or YouTube, and simply you can take this ticket and place it on their desk, and it asks that they come and see you at the end of class, and again, we notify the chair of our department that that ticket has been issued, and I've never had to issue a ticket more than once, and actually when the rest of the class sees the ticket, they realize that, you know, it is something that is viewed as disruptive and a distraction that is not tolerated in the classroom and usually the activity stops.